Car accidents, neck injuries, smoking, and cancer can all cause irreparable harm to the trachea, the flexible tube that keeps us breathing normally. Researchers developing new windpipes to help those who have serious or life threatening damage. As Leslie Mouton shows us, 3D printed tracheas could be medicine's next big thing. Researchers and surgeons teaming up to see if a lab grown windpipe helps this animal breathe better. They're hoping that what works for this pig will someday soon work in people. An unstable airway is a potential time bomb and it has to be addressed. Robert Lubovix is an expert in diseases of the upper airway. He's part of a team testing a 3D printed trachea. The trachea or windpipe is the four inch hollow tube connecting your voice box to the bronchi in your lungs. The tube can narrow or harden due to injury or disease. And unlike other organs in the body, it can't be replaced with another human organ. In the trachea, there is no good blood supply to be able to sew blood vessels together to, uh, to effect a transplant. Dr. Lubovix and Bora are looking at a viable replacement. Using 3D printing technology, researchers construct the tube or scaffold out of a biodegradable material then stem cells are placed inside. So the stem cells that we embed within our biologic trachea um, have been primed uh, to turn into cartilage. Within 18 months, the scaffold is likely to disintegrate, leaving the trachea in its place. I think for a lot of patients, uh, it will be life-altering, life-changing. In, in some patients, it's going to be life-saving. Researchers say they have had success in animal models. They believe human trials on the 3D-printed trachea are about 18 months to two years away. Leslie Mouton, KSAT 12 News.